right. We are back and we are ready to eat. Food has been prepared. Got these good looking Hawaiian pineapple baked pork chops. Is that what that is? Oh, yes. Okay. Some salad and some cheese baked potatoes with some okay. garlic bread. Let's so we are ready to eat. Okay. Lord, thank you for this day. We thank you for this fellowship time. And God, we thank you for this food that we're about to receive for the nourishment of our bodies. For Christ's sake, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Oh, my God. It's two days in a row. Is this a cooking show or something you want? Just cooking for you. All right, here we go with the uh, grill crab. This is nice looking. What are these, baby? Those are cheese baked potatoes, and they are awesome. Oh, you know, you have one They are there? cooked with love, let me tell you. They go great with the baked pineapple uh, pork chops. Is it going to be sweet? Um, well, you know. We'll see. A sweet person, that. maybe. Go ahead them? Yeah. Ooh, look at that. Look at the pineapples on. It's funny, bro. I don't like that many pineapples. Though. Okay, well, you, you do you. What else we got? Salad? We got salad. You was on the ball today. Oh, Y'all tune yeah. in tomorrow. Maybe I can get this again. <laughs> Shit. What else we got with, man? This is nice. I like this channel. Okay. You gotta say it, you're you gonna do it again? No, I'm just waiting on my ranch. You can get a little, a little blessing, man. Oh, you want a ranch? Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's see what we're working Dig with. Dig in honey. and see what we're working with. Uh huh, that was it. I'm all ready. Y'all don't listen to me. Ooh, woo, it's a bite. <laughs> Getting let that hot taste. sauce with it. Let me taste this. Let, this, let it be sweet and see what happens. <laughs> well, it, pineapples are naturally sweet. Mm, um, like them sweet. Mm -hmm. You like me? Yeah, you sweet as bear meat. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm trust the pineapple because it's got some more seasoning on it. Okay, mm -hmm. That's right up your alley. I don't like the pineapple. Mm -hmm. Well, it goes good with anything. Anything. That's right. Mm, this is nice. Yeah. Yeah, yo. You say you are post-menopause? What is that? Perimenopause. That's what it's called? Peri? Yes. What, that, what, what are the symptoms of that? How do you know? My gynecologist told me. You told me what? That I was going through. Starting to go through. She went through it already? Yeah, she's... She's trained, so she knows Thank all you. the symptoms that I'm experiencing. Mm -hmm. And what ages do they usually reach? That the pre? It depends. Mm -hmm. Some people do. They always go through pre. Or? It really depends on the woman. You can't really say because what I got going on with my body may be totally different from somebody else. So. Mm -hmm. Some people go through it a lot earlier than was expected. What's the earliest you've heard somebody going through it? Really early. Like 20 something? Like late 30s. Really? Mm hmm. I bet she held to be around. A lot of people don't have the information. If they go see their doctor, they 
They will want them. That's true. And then most of the time, women are affected. And they don't even realize that they're just going through the motion, going through different things happening to their body, and they don't really know why they're so emotional, why they got so many things going on. They got pills for this type of stuff? Excuse me, they do. But it's a process, you know. You got to draw labs and see where you're at with your lab work and your panels. All kinds of things don't come in effect. Mm -hmm. So you ain't made it to that point where you got to take pills. I have. So what you recommend to little girls? There's nothing they can do to stop that, is hmm? Little girl. Yeah, women, little girls is coming up. There's nothing they can do to stop that. It's just it's hereditary for all women. Pretty much. I don't them us you men ain't got nothing. Y'all go do stuff. Too. So we go. Y'all go through all kinds of stuff. These niggas, but not be walking around here acting like they got a period. Well, not that, but period some things. There is some of them that walk around like they got a period. Of your lap. Testosterone, oh, testosterone's are low. You know what I'm saying? They got apps for that. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most important thing is self-love. Self-love. So when you have self-love, then you're more apt to go to the doctor and start getting a daily physical one, seeing what's going on early on. So a lot of stuff can be prevented. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like That's why men out. and women. You got pineapples, and I didn't get any. You can have mine. You can have all of them. Oh, yes. So, who are you going for on this fight on the 29th? Mm, I am a Blake Crawford fan. Die hard. Have you ever been to one of his fights? Yes, I have. Okay. If I had it my way, financially, I'd be at all of them. They ain't going to all of them. God damn. All of them. We are what? But I was blessed to be able to at least go to one, and it happened yep. to be in Omaha. So no I'm okay too. with that. Did you enjoy yourself? Mm -hmm. I'm glad you did. I was going with John Malin. <laughs> no, Who are you going for? <laughs> Who are you going for? Oh, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm gonna tell. You, I'm, a, I'm a Spence fan. You know that. But he, he, I hate he had to fight my boy. But somebody old has got to go. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, I'm glad they fight. It's definitely going to be a good one. Historical moment. Epic. What's the word? And I ask. Epic? Epic. <laughs> Historical. Definitely going down in the boat. Oh, you talking about the word part? You just shoot them out there. Epic. Mm -hmm. Historical. They both going to lose. So, you know, the way I look at it is they both winners. Mm. But when somebody got to lose, you mm, know, nice. somebody got to lose. And I hope it's Spence. Mm. Mm. But what I do pray. They both buck out safely. Everybody's healthy. That's right, man. Yeah. You tell me. 
It's, it is a fight. So it's a fight. It is, you know, let's keep in mind that it is a fight. It's a sporting event. Happens to be dangerous, but. You can get, you, it was dangerous of, walking your dog. That's true. So, but, you know, we're not dealing with hitting somebody in the head and breaking jaws and. So I like go into boxing, but you know. Yeah, they train for that. Train to do it. They love to do it. You know, respect the game. And I like street fighting. You, get, you got to do that for free. Yeah. And all mine doing. How you like those potatoes? They're falling in my mouth. You're a potato man. Yeah, good, baby. No. Needed some bacon? No, I didn't need no bacon. <laughs> what they call them? Twice baked? With okay, bacon? Take us home. Well, we hope you enjoy tuning in with us. Hit that like button. And subscribe. And subscribe. To the war. We got more coming. Hope everybody have a blessed day. Goodbye. Goodbye. Bless you, Evelyn Champagne King. Goodbye.